show you how to connect your Xbox Series S or X via LAN cable so you have a direct uh, internet connection opposed to using Wi-Fi. So first thing is go ahead and grab your LAN cable or basically your Ethernet cable, something like this. I have a long 50 footer because my router's in the living room and I have to walk the cable all the way to the bedroom to the Xbox. So on one end of the LAN cable, I'm gonna stick into here in the Xbox, like that. So I get the LAN cable come all the way to my living room. And now over here, you can see I have a modem here and I have a router. Some of you guys have may have a um, modem slash router in the one. Okay, but all you gotta do is, so I do have a router here. Now you can see all the extra ports I have here. So now I just gotta connect it to one of these ethernet ports, it doesn't matter. I'll just go ahead and choose this one right here. Okay, it just clicked into place. So after you connect it, there's nothing else to do. You should be good to go. However, you can go ahead and double check if you wish. You can go to your Xbox and just go to the settings, click on the Xbox button, go to the settings, the gear icon up there. And then from here, uh, just make sure you're under general and then go to network settings right there. Now under manage wireless networks, it should say wired now, okay? If I unplug the ethernet cable or the LAN cable and I refresh this, then it'll say it'll be connected to my Wi-Fi. But anyway, it's wired. We can also test the connection speed. If I just go down, test network speed and statistics, I'll select that. Wait for like 30 seconds on this uh, page here. And you can see my wired connection status, download speed, 550. You can test it on Wi-Fi too. I just did it on the Wi-Fi. I think it was like 200 for download speed. Latency for the uh, LAN cable, it's 23 milliseconds. I think when I did the Wi-Fi, I think it was like 26 milliseconds latency. Anyway, do you guys go?